Close your eyes and imagine this. It's 480 BCE, the world as you know it hangs in the balance. Hundreds of Persian warships, massive, towering, seemingly invincible, are closing in on you. You're one of the Greeks, vastly outnumbered, and the fate of your civilization rests in the hands of just a few hundred ships. Most people think this battle was a sure victory for the mighty Persian Empire, but what if I told you it wasn't? The Battle of Salamis, the underdog story no one saw coming. How did the smaller, outgunned Greek navy manage to defeat an empire that spanned continents? What trick, what twist of fate turned the tide of history? You see, this battle wasn't just about brute strength, it was about cunning, courage, and a dangerous gamble that paid off. And here's the part that might shock you, the Greeks didn't just fight to protect themselves. They fought knowing if they lost, their entire way of life, their democracy, their art, their future, would vanish. But let's rewind for a moment. The Persian Empire had just burned Athens. Imagine the fear, the desperation. The people looked out over the water, knowing their survival was riding on a battle most thought couldn't be won. The Greek fleet was waiting, hiding in the narrow strait of Salamis, and the Persian commander, Xerxes, thought they had them trapped. But here's what the Persians didn't understand. Sometimes being outnumbered isn't a disadvantage. It's an advantage. The Greeks knew these waters, their smaller, faster ships darted in and out of the strait, while the Persian fleet, huge and unwieldy, couldn't maneuver. The tides, the wind, everything played into the hands of the Greeks. And by the end of that day, the mighty Persian navy was in ruins. Hundreds of ships sank, thousands of soldiers drowned, and Xerxes, the king who once believed he was unstoppable, watched in disbelief. This was no ordinary battle. It was the moment that changed the course of Western civilization. If the Greeks had lost, the Persian Empire could have crushed the cradle of democracy, silencing the voices of Athens forever. But they didn't lose, and because of that, the world as we know it today exists. The question is, what would have happened if they had lost? Would we be living in a world shaped by Persian ideals? Would democracy as we know it have ever come to be? So what do you think? Could such a battle so distant in time have shaped the modern world? If you found this story intriguing, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more historical twists and epic tales that will change the way you see history. Thanks for watching Shorts Fact Entertainment, where history becomes entertainment.